Hi, I'm John Schaffner, an astronaut here on the International Space Station. We're 250 miles above Earth at 17,500 miles an hour. And we do a lot of really cool science up here. Come join us. Science is fun. Hey, there's a lot of great science that goes on here on the ISS. Let's go find some and make it fun, shall we? But first, I have a question for you. What did Neil Armstrong say when no one laughed at his moon jokes? Well, I guess you had to be there. Aww. Well, anyway, today let's talk about something really fun, ham radio. It's one of the world's most popular hobbies. It's even used as disaster relief in most countries around the world. So you'd think if something were this popular, maybe it would be on the ISS also. So let's take a look today at ham radio on the ISS. Okay, very nice. Give my friend a good hello if you know him. Best wishes. Godspeed to you. So I'm here in the Columbus module. This is where we keep the Aeris equipment, the ham radio equipment. Uh, we make contacts with people all over the world. You know, I got my ham license when I was 13 years old, but back then we used Morse code only. Here on station, we use two meter voice and it works really, really well. Just like the radio you see in cars, amateur radio uses a transceiver and an antenna to pick up and send out radio signals that carry communication to other radio devices listening on a particular frequency. Because the uh, space station has a very popular call sign, when we reach out, there's a lot of people ready to talk to us. One problem is we're traveling at 17,500 miles an hour around the Earth, so we're only over one place on Earth for a few moments. So we have to be quick. Today, we're gonna to try to reach uh, Middlesbrough Middle School, you know, where I grew up, but we're actually over Europe. So we've got an Italian ground station gonna relay it to Middlesbrough. Let's see if it works. IK1 SLD, OR4 ISS. Good afternoon, John. Happy delivery ground station calling for a scheduled Irish contact. Uh, do you copy, John, over? Yes, I read you loud and clear. Very nice to hear you, thank you. Okay, go ahead uh, the first question, please. Hello, my name is Trey Ray. Can you describe your initial emotions during your entry into space and docking to the station? Over. Hi, Trey. Wow, it was just real pure excitement. I came on board the space station and it was like, wow, it looks just like the pictures, only better. A lot of fun and the rocket ride here was even more fantastic. Good luck, Middlesboro. It's been wonderful talking to you guys. Wow, so that was cool. <laughs> 17,500 miles an hour, 250 miles above Earth, somewhere on the other side of the planet, able to talk to your hometown. That's cool, but that's ham radio. Just wait till you get up here and try it for yourself. 